is going on in there. I hope you've had a good summer off. Now it's time to get back to work. T-Dot Salt Pile is a TV star during winter weather, but this past summer, well, the salt has been taking it easy. You've laid around all summer, now it's time to get back to work. Now, just a few weeks before fall, trucks are hauling in 360 loads of salt to make sure Tennessee is ready for another winter. We're getting it in early this year. Eight tons alone will fill up this bin that holds salt for Davidson and Williamson counties. In order for us to get to 8,000 tons in the bins, we have to store it as high as possible. A few salty facts. As long as it remains covered and out of the weather, salt can last forever. T-Dot never has to throw it away unless somehow it becomes contaminated. And you wouldn't want to put this stuff on your french fries because unlike its edible counterpart, road salt isn't processed to remove the chemicals. It's treated with anti-caking chemicals too so that loaders can scoop it easily. And why is this year's salt blue? It's from Louisiana. Personnel seem to think the blue works better. Uh, I don't know the chemical reaction to that or what the chemical analysis is, but they like the blue better. And how can we forget about salt's best friend, brine? Come on now, you guys have got to work together. Salt and brine, as you know, are stars in the winter. But in the summer, well, they just want to take it slow. Come winter, we'll all be ready.